Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back. It's Courtney C. Today I'm going to be reviewing my newest purchase. It is the Long Shop Le Pliage City Tote Bag in black coated canvas. I'm going to be covering a few things in this video. Details, do I recommend? Also, um, how I'm going to be implementing this into my daily life. By the way, I make videos dedicated to style, healthy hair, my life as a teacher, and reviews because I have a super critical eye and I do not have money to waste. If you like content like this, go ahead and hit subscribe. Join the Courtney C family. I would absolutely love to have you. All right, let's go ahead and get started. All right, let's get into the details of this beautiful bag. Immediately, this purse caught my eye because I love the coated canvas detail. It's so nice and luxurious looking. Um, to me, this bag just looks way more expensive than what I paid for it. I think I paid $239 for it, but I'll have the purse link down below and I will tell you exactly how much I paid for it down below. It's in a solid black. What I love the most is the beautiful straps. They are nice and sturdy and the stitching along the um, ends of the straps. I really am a stickler for those details. Just like the typical long shop totes, you will see the two leather tabs at the end. That just gives you that long shop appeal. And then at the bottom, you see two stripes going across the bottom to give it somewhat of structure. And then on the sides, you see two tufts and like a triangular a little indention at the bottom and then the same on the other side. Now let's face the bag towards the front again. What you guys see is what you typically see in the light pliage totes. You see the flap at the front and then you see the little um, square pocket and that's about it. I absolutely love the silver detailing of this bag and I also love this little brown tassel detail as well. I think that that's so cute and so chic for daily life. Now, like I told you guys, I'm a stickler for details. I absolutely love the zipper. I think that the zipper is so beautiful. And this bag actually reminds me so much of the Louis Vuitton Neverpool in Epi. It reminds me so much of it because the canvas Looks a lot like that bag, just in my opinion. You tell me what you think, I'll have that bag link below as well. Now let's get into the inside of the bag, which is what I love. So I do have a purse organizer in the bag. This is what I used in my other long shop bag and I got this off of Amazon. I'll have something linked down below similar to that. And what you'll find in the inside is a brown, cloth-like material. Now I'm very careful with that material, so I do keep a purse organizer in my bag. I'm just very um, leery about throwing things just inside of the bag because you don't want to ruin it. You see two large pockets. There is one large pocket facing the back side of the tote. It's a pretty nice size. And then you see another pocket in the front of the tote. Nothing else really to it, just the large inside. And there's also a tag on the end that has, I'm sure the item number, and it says Long Shop. So this is the interior of the bag. Now, let's get into how I plan on wearing this bag in my daily life. So as I told you in my intro, I am a teacher, but I do teach virtually, so I'm back and forth working from home, working in a building. But for those days that I will work in the building, I want to have a nice, reliable tote. So I thought that this would be a great fit for my life. It's chic because I love fashion, but it also lugs the materials that I need. I will have down below in the description box how much weight that this tote can actually handle. But what I also love about this tote compared to the Louis Vuitton Neverfull bag is that the straps have a drop. Now, if you're comparing this to the Louis Vuitton Neverfull, because I am, because it reminds me so much of the Neverfull and Epi, that handbag will tote features short, thin straps. I know those thin straps carry a lot of weight, but there is a drop which allows you to be able to comfortably wear this bag with the coat opposed to the other never full bag that I was speaking of. 
So for me, this just works, especially in the winter months, but I will be carrying this year round. Additionally, I also will be wearing this bag on the weekends. I don't know about you guys, but on the weekends when I'm visiting friends and I'm carrying multiple things that cannot fit into my small handbags because I'm an extremist, I either carry super large bags or super small bags. I like to have a bag that I can stuff some things in um, just when I'm going out and about. And I just really plan on using this as a weekend bag. And I think that this will serve the purpose in a cute understated way. Do I recommend this purse? Absolutely. I think that you'll be getting a bang for your buck and you'll be very pleased with the quality of this bag. I think for the price tag, this really looks like a very chic upscale purse and I think that this will wear well. Should I review this bag again in six months, a month, a year? I happily will and I will tell you how this wears over time. If you made it to the end of this video, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate your support. Please leave me a comment down below. I love interacting with you guys. Tell me what you think of this long shop bag. Tell me if you have multiple. I'm just now starting to really get into long shop. This is my second bag. So tell me what you think. And also like this video because it really helps me as I'm really trying to grow my channel. All right. Subscribe. I hope to see you guys in my next video. And enjoy your day. Bye.